the same meaning of giving energy, mm -hmm. you know, your energy to ground, through praying, through talking to God. Is, this, is, uh, is that what you mean? Yes, well, it's a way of saying, you know, yoga means union, you know, yeah. union. In Spanish, we also imagine in the Spanish language, the languages is very important, no? We should always be very aware of the languages, of the origin of words and this, because there's a lot of secrets in words and in languages. There's, a, we say, coming from Greek, etymologia, you heard this, no? Etymologos, logos is word in Greek. Etymos is the, the, the truth meaning of the words, no? So it's very important if you're a student to have or look for etymological dictionary, no? Which goes mining, mining again in the meaning, in the deep meaning of the words, no? So yoga means union. Union be, in between what? Union in between heaven and earth, between spirit and materia, in between men and God, Union, the, the yoga, and if you read Bhagavad Gita, you know this book? Bhagavad Gita, very important. It's a Hindu book. Bhagavad Gita is a classic. It's like Bhagavad. Bhagavad, maybe NH here, Bhagavad Gita. Very important, explaining the five yogas, no, here. Five, there are five yogas, no? The basic yoga is Hatha Yoga. Hatha Yoga is, uh, is this uh, exercises, physical exercises. No? Then you have um, the end of the fifth yoga is Nyanya Yoga. Ganya, Nyanya Yoga, which means uh, knowledge yoga. No? So you have the, the Bhagavad Gita explaining very good the five yogas. No? But Alhamdulillah, uh, Holy Quran. And uh, Holy Prophet, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, himself is a big yoga. It's a big union, no? So I was very happy, for example, when I started praying, you know, standing, ruku, sajda. In sajda, again up, they say this, when you put in, in, in sitting, you, you bend your foot. All, this is yoga. There's a very, very interesting book about what benefits for your, uh, in the, because we have three worlds, okay? Physical, uh, physical being, we have psychological being, and we have a spiritual being, no? Very important, these three things, no? Very, very, very important. And, the, and Islam is touching the three every time, every time. When you are praying, your physical body, no? When you make ruku, your kidneys are you, especially working, you know? Your psychological thing is in, the, in humbleness in before of Allah. When you are in sajda, same. In Islam, it's very important, sajda. It's the only thing, well, in Buddhism, there's also sajda. But in sajda, you are like this, your head is here. And your, and your heart is here, no? It's the only moment in the day the heart is bump, pumping extra blood in the brain, okay? No? So sajda is very important physically because you are extra, extra pumping blood in the brain. When you're standing, the brain is here and the heart is here, no? Alhamdulillah is pumping the blood up, upstairs in your brain. But when you make sajda, you make it extra pumping, you know. And there's a book, a very, very, very important book explaining all these things and the benefits you have, psychological, physical benefits for the liver, for the kidneys, for the brains, for everything in all the, in the, in all the whole salad, no? So the salad is complete Hatha Yoga. No? Okay, if you are, I don't know if you're asking this.